I'm not a proponent of affirmative action either. I'm not an MRA. I'm no longer a feminist and apparently made a piss poor one when I tried. I'm not an atheist. I'm not an atheism plus fan. I'm not a Christian, though I was raised as one, but not in the strict way others experienced. And I've never taken up any other religions. I'm not a Republican. I'm not a Democrat. I'm not a Libertarian, if by that we mean the neoconservative hijacking of the label. I'm not affiliated with any particular political party. I'm no longer a member of the NRA, as of a few years now. I'm not in favor of stricter gun control measures. I'm neither a nationalist, nor a Marxist, nor a capitalist. I'm not a cable TV subscriber. I'm not on Facebook. And obviously I'm not an entertainer. Thanks goes out to Voluntarily Redacted's channel for giving me the idea for this video. But now, I may live under a rock, and I very well may be a Luddite of sorts. And I've been told I'm a bit of a contrarian, though I personally consider it reflective. I am a ponderer, and I also likely am a dork, you know, which is made evident by my enthusiasm for Weird Al Yankovic tunes. In fact, I've been a Weird Al fan longer than nearly anything else. By some people's standards, I'm a little bit of a redneck. Don't hate on me for drinking bush light, you know, cheap domestics. I mean, that's not all I drink, but it's cheap. It's affordable. I might call myself a humanist, but what do we really mean when we say that? We care about human beings and human life. Well, sure, we're all a bunch of humans. But this notion is so broad that it can be adapted to appear compatible with a wide variety of ideologies. Just ask most self-professed feminists and MRAs, atheists, and Christians. Egalitarian is a word that I remain hesitant about using. People start talking about equality of opportunity, I start wondering how we might bring it about, and all schemes continue to involve a big centralized government, and I'm not uh, able to be down with that. Equality of opportunity, equality of outcome, I mean, really, in the end, what's the flippin' fucking difference? Both, probably, are going to be brought about, in people's imaginations anyway, via big government. So, there you go.